Hello guys, and welcome to a very simple tutorial video that I'm going to be showing you guys. This is a tutorial on how to get custom key bindings in Geometry Dash. Now, if you do not know what I mean, I mean, as you can see over here, if you open up Geometry Dash and go into settings and then press options and then keys, as you can see, it just shows you all the key bindings. But over here it says custom key bindings is not yet supported. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys how to change your custom key bindings. As you can see, you can only jump with space and up arrow key and click. But let's say you want to jump with enter. Right now I'm pressing enter and it can't jump. As you can, you can hear that sound through the mic. That's the exact sound that happens when I press enter. So now I'm going to show you guys how, how to press enter. When I press enter, I will jump. I'm going to show you guys how to get custom key bindings. So, what you're going to want to do is very simple. Um, go down into the link in the description and then download um, this program called Key Tweak. You'll be sent to this page in the description. Just press download and then download the installer to Key Tweak. And once you're in the installer, I already installed it, so I'm not going to reinstall it. Just keep press I agree and then all of that. Okay. Once you're done with that, what you should do is after you're done with it, you will not see a desktop um, icon. I repeat, you will not see a desktop icon. What you're going to have to do is go into the start menu and under recently added, open up key tweak. If you're using anything other than Windows 10, like Windows 8 or Windows 7, open up the start, start menu or on Windows 8, the charm bar, and just search for key tweak and then open up key tweak. After that, you will get this page. So, what we want to do is we want to change, this is enter, 43 is enter, as you can see it says enter when I hover over it. We're going to click that, and then it's currently mapped to enter, but what I want to do is map it to a thing that jumps. So that when I press it, it's basically simulating either up arrow or spacebar, which means jump. What you're going to want to do is enter, you know, in this case I'll be using enter, and then what you're going to want to do is either map it to spacebar or up arrow key. Let's say you want you play with spacebar and you be in every single level with spacebar. I would definitely not recommend changing enter to spacebar because then spacebar would do this would just not jump and you use spacebar. So I would recommend if you use spacebar use up arrow key. If you play with up arrow key use spacebar. Anyway after that what you're gonna want to do is go ahead and it says you can see it says it's currently mapped to enter. What you're gonna do wanna do is map it. I'm gonna use up arrow key just because I want to use that and then up arrow. And then what you're gonna wanna do is press remap key and then press apply. Then as you can see over here it says it has been updated. It says you will need to restart your computer for the changes to take effect. Would you like to restart your computer now? Okay guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and restart my computer just to show this. I have to and I have to stop the recording and then restart it back on after I'm done restarting, otherwise I'll lose the footage. So yeah. I'll go ahead and see you guys on the other side after I'm done restarting my computer. Okay guys, well, I am back after restarting my computer. And, um, as you can see, if we open up Geometry Dash, as you can see, there's no sneaky stuff. If I go into Options Keys, I didn't, like, download a weird version of Geometry Dash, and now, this is the moment we've all been waiting for. I am pressing Enter, and I am jumping. If you do not believe that I'm pressing Enter, I'm going to press it. You can hear that sound? That was the same sound that was made earlier when I was pressing Enter. So yes, I am pressing enter to jump. As you can see, I my screen is jumping. This is not using some special sneaky things like recording the video and then recording the sound. No, this is 100% legit. I just wanted to make this video to help some of you guys who wanted custom key binding in Jump Dash but didn't know how, as it says it's not allowed. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe and like if this helped you out. And uh, yeah. Peace, guys.